In this video, we'll show you how to use PowerPoint's Morph Transitions to create turntable animations. You can use this technique to animate your PowerPoint 3D illustrations. For this tutorial, we're using our Fighter Jet 3D model. This model is part of our large collection of reference PowerPoint 3D models. The collection comes with our online course, The Beginner's Guide to Creating PowerPoint 3D Models. The link is provided in the description section of this video. Let's go. Get your 3D illustration ready. Duplicate the slide by pressing Ctrl D. We now have the starting slide, the middle slide, and the last slide. Select the middle slide and repose the model. Turn it 180 degrees in the opposite direction. You can also enter the value in the text box. In the Transitions tab, choose the Morph Transition. PowerPoint automatically shows a preview of the new transition. You can see that it turns in the clockwise direction. Set the slide to advance after 0 seconds. We'll use the default transition duration of 2 seconds. Do this for the other two slides as well. The preview shows that the animation automatically returns to the ending position in a counterclockwise direction. We want it to continue rotating clockwise. Let's fix this. The trick is to set a shorter turning angle in the clockwise direction. Morph will turn the model in this clockwise direction. Now we'll duplicate the first slide again to make sure that we end up with the same pose as the starting pose. This is needed especially for making seamless continuous looping animations. If you want, you can adjust the transition duration for the last slide as shown. The animation is done. Let's make an improvement to better showcase your 3D illustration. If you want to show the top side of the model, set the Y rotation control to tilt it down. In this example, we're setting the jet's nose with a downward pitch. Make sure the poses in the first and last slides are identical. For the middle pose, we'll set the jet to pitch upward. And don't forget about the third slide. Congratulations! The turntable animation is complete. With morph transitions, we see these brief pauses or stops between slides. Morph also always adds ease in and ease out effects. In the next video, we'll show you how to create smooth and seamless looping turntable animations using our turntable animator add-in. Check out the free version of the tool, our Turntable Animator Lite. The link is provided in the description of this video. Happy creating!